All that is coming up here on Atlanta's Home and Style. Thanks for joining us. I'm Donna Davis. We are once again focusing on remodeling, giving you ideas of things you can do to improve the look and function of your home. In today's spotlight, outdoor living spaces. They are becoming more popular and more elaborate than ever. Remodeling your deck or patio gives you the chance to combine the beauty of nature with the comforts of home. That's the idea behind this year's Contractor of the Year Award for Residential Exterior Specialty. Like so many of us, Elizabeth Richards wanted more space for outdoor entertaining. So she's thrilled with the remodeling project that created all of this. You know, on the weekends we'll go sit out there and uh, we've been known to watch a good Georgia game out there and turn the TV on. But it's also become a place when any one of us want to get away. Uh, we go out there and I'll look out and my daughter will be sitting out there with a blanket on her watching television or reading a book. So it's, it's become an interesting space that's just an extra room. So tell me about this, what you did over here. Well, Her remodeler, Dan Weidman of Weidman & Associates, helped Elizabeth change the space from an ordinary deck and carport to all of this. He also built a three-car carriage, breezeway, and a mudroom, all part of the architect Todd Pritchett's plan. One of the biggest challenges was building on land with a steep grade. What we had to do is try and make that happen without it looking like we had built the project on stilts. While Dan took on the tough terrain, Elizabeth focused on the colors. The beadboard wet red ceiling always was something that I just thought was neat with gray. And um, so the colors really pushed me because they feel like a room, but yet they're still very calming like the outside. One of the things that we've done in this deck is brought together a lot of different textures, features, and materials, but in a very subtle way. And the colors that were chosen by the homeowner to finish it out really soften um, the, all the elements, but also tie them together so that the extent of the beams and the, uh, the stone fireplace, the wood flooring in the exterior, just all together come, come together to create a very warm environment. From this huge stone wood-burning fireplace to the striking red ceiling and the overall classic comfortable look, this outdoor space impressed members of the National Association for the Remodeling Industry. The project won the Contractor of the Year Award in Atlanta for Best Residential Exterior Specialty. When Dan called and said, you, know, you won. You actually won. I think it's neat. Very happy with the end result. I'd like to have this at my house. Elizabeth says one of the things she likes most about the project is having a covered breezeway. You know, I am such a fluff chick that I, I just can't be out in the weather too long or I may melt. So I, I wanted something that connected the house. I, I enjoy detached garages, but I don't enjoy them when it's raining. Elizabeth says she now has her home just the way she wants it, but it's been a work in progress. Well, it started out with a traditional Georgia brick house, so we had very boxy rooms, a lot of them. The first project involved moving a wall to open up the kitchen. He took out a wall in the kitchen originally. Um, we, we laugh, the Weidman and I, the whole gang, we laugh about this wall in the kitchen. We moved the wall three times. It may have been a small project, but it solidified a connection with Weidman and Associates. They have just been great to work with, and because we knew them and we were comfortable with them, that really gave them an edge up. So when Elizabeth was ready to add on to the house, she called Weidman again. This time, they added a master suite, a powder room, and an office. It's a wide open space. They've got separate counters in there. So again, they each have their own space within a large area. They also have, and what's very common is, in a master suite when it's possible is making it large enough to not only accommodate the, the bedroom furnishings but also a separate sitting area. Weidman says the master bath shows the trend towards stone. Stone is almost a consistent desire of every one of our clients. The um, heavy glass shower door and shower enclosure and that open look as well as plenty of light. You get a big space, a lot of light, stone and glass. It just makes an impressive statement and again it's a very nice calm, soothing way to start the day. And the study gives the Richards plenty of space away from the noise of children upstairs. So after the addition, Elizabeth couldn't wait to remodel the kitchen. It started with a very square, very unimpressive kitchen. Dan began by removing the wall between the kitchen and the family room. It basically was a very crowded kitchen with large appliances 
and it was cut off from the rest of the house. Elizabeth played a role in selecting all the colors and finishes. I love the simplicity of the kitchen. I love that there is not a lot that takes your eye. The backsplash has always been one of my favorites, and I like it that it, you, it gets its interest from the design, not the color. The granite I really enjoy because it, it's got a little bit of red, which the island is red, and I love that, the, I love that, the contrast in those colors. She's got the bold red on the island, which is outstanding, but it's softened by the color of the cabinetry as well as the countertops and the backsplash. But again, a lot of texture, similar to what, what has gone on out on the porch bringing in a lot of texture, but keeping the colors soft and comfortable. Dan says the trend here in the Richards Kitchen of hiding and blending the appliances is growing. Now they're simply integrated. It downplays the magnitude of the appliances. The Richards Kitchen and Family Room went through quite a transformation. The Family Room was a step down. We raised the floor up, so now the floor is at the same height and flows together, and then we, we put in the wood flooring to tie in with the existing and the rest of the house. Also, the ceiling was flat. We went back in and trade the ceiling to give you some added height and uh, a nice decorative feature in that space. Dan says bringing the kitchen and family room together like this is very popular as people are looking for openness and togetherness. It's been three remodels together and the Richards are thrilled with their home and their friends at Weidman. I'm very happy. I'm very happy. I'm very content with it. I love this business because of the opportunity it gives me to work with some great people like Elizabeth Richards and her husband Ken. And in doing so, it gives us an opportunity. We're working in people's homes. We're, we're part of their family in the, for a period of time. And frequently, at the end of the job, they don't want to see us leave. And that it just warms my heart. For more information on remodeling, go to WeidmanRemodeling.com. As we mentioned in the feature, Weidman & Associates won the Contractor of the Year Award for Residential Exterior Specialty. The Cody Award for remodeling the entire house to...